leaving your videos up to chance. Hi, my name is Samuel F. Robinson and in this video, we're going to look at YouTube Studio for individuals that make their own videos and have their channels. I'm gonna go over five key th points that you can look at when checking out the video, when you're auditing your video. Let's dive in. Right now you're looking at my screen and you see I'm already logged into YouTube Studio. You can do this on the computer. You can do this on your phone. You download it to your phone. Once you go in, you look at the video that you want to audit and on the overview, you'll see that it shows the metrics for the video. So this one here is comparing your average performance to your video's performance. And you can see that this video had 3,100 views more than total average. It outperformed six out of the 10 videos that were posted recently. Also, you can see that it had a total of 195 hours of watch time. As you know, in YouTube, you need 4,000 watch hours before you can monetize as well as some additional requirements. This video alone added 18 viewers to the site. Now, mind you, this site is a tech site and where we empower individuals, specifically business owners, I find that on the channel, which I can show you later in another video, what the makeup of the viewers are. But note that 18 viewers were added. Let's get back to the reach. So YouTube recommended this video for others to watch. And there were some people browsing, looking for it as well. And 29,000 impressions, 29,700 impressions were made. Now you're looking at the click-through rate, which is of the 29,000, approximately 8% of them clicked. Of course, you want this number to be higher, but in this particular case, it's 8.7 individuals, percent of individuals clicked which yielded total views of 3,000, which is approximately, hmm, this is approximately 1%, 10% actually. This is approximately 10% of the total impression. So 10% is not bad. Of course, you can always want to improve that. So let's look at this block here same information is here but in a funnel form so you can see as it breaks down 96 percent um eight percent click through which was 2500 views and average watch time was 4.00 which amounted to 166 hours of watch time now, the question that I ask is never leave it up to chance. What would you change here? Look at the browse features. So people who browsed it, it was suggested 35% of the time, 3% of the 28,000 search for it, and then other features, 1%. And then if I had shared it, actually I did. I see the 9%. Let's make this bigger. So you can see that 1% is others. Just a little under 1% was shared directly. So I literally sent it to people. And then 3.6 search for it. And this is the breakdown of the traffic here. And so I recently showed you how we average this down and what you can change to increase that effectiveness. 
So the average viewer watched it for 3.44 and 2 point, um, 2.40 more than the usual. If you're looking here at the time frame, so when the video initially came out, it didn't really do much. But as the time progressed, at some point, it began to pick up. Now, if I wanted to keep climbing, there's something that I need to change. Otherwise, it'll start declining. So this was a good video. The question is, is it good for my channel? And then here, there's a couple key things we can change. As you can see, this is the average viewing of the channel, and this is the rate. So it's on decline with the trend, but we can change that. So we're going to change a few things. And here it's telling us that 93% of the people loved it, and less than 5% clicked the screen at the end and nobody remixed it all right let's go and look at the audience so of the 18 subscribers that it added and the 20 and the 2.8 thousand unique viewers 12 of them returned and they return later. So as you see the numbers climbing here at the highest 266 new viewers. And it still continues to spike periodically. And ironically, most of them are males. Now this is something that you want to look at here. The subscribers. So less than 1% are subscribed. 99% are not subscribed. So they're just watching the video, but they don't subscribe. So when I recently looked at this, I found that a lot of the countries here in the islands and in the Philippines were watching it. UK and the United States. So how do you trans transform this into sales? We're going to get into that in a future video. So I wanted to just go over the five key points you want to look at, which is who's watching your video so that you know how to speak to them. How, what's your click through rate, total impressions to total clicks. And then how many subscribers you are looking at. So these are the things that you need to focus on when looking at your video. How do you change these effects now? You can remake a new video. One of the things that I would say is look at the thumbnail. You can change the thumbnail. You can also change the title. And you can change the description. That's at the lower end is the description. And then change your keywords. Those are the five ways that you would create more life for this particular video and the video that you have. If you're interested in having me audit your channel, looking at it and see ways that it can improve, click in the notes up below, leave a comment, and then we'll set up a time where we can either do it live or we can do it as a private session and i charge for my private sessions all right that's it for today my name is samuel f robinson you're watching this on samuel f robinson youtube channel and i will see you in the next video click the video in one of these areas to watch the next video remember to like and subscribe to the channel and give me some feedback I'd appreciate that. Thank you.